Hey guys, so it's been a hot minute. I have been sick, I've had some technology issues, got some new equipment, some different equipment. Hopefully things are going to go well and maybe I'll get on a schedule. I'm gonna say that every video until it happens and it's not gonna happen until YouTube pays me money for doing YouTube, I don't think. Or we hit the lottery or um, yeah, I think those are my options. So, yeah, share this video <laughs> so that YouTube can pay me, because that would be great if you could like and subscribe. I know I haven't done the fun stuff yet, but if you like and subscribe, YouTube might pay me and I could do this more. And maybe get on a schedule. Like, my crazy, like, I have Capricorn in my, in my chart, guys, and you know those Capricorns, like, they're on it. Those type A Capricorns, that's what's in my chart. And yeah, I want to be it, but I suck at it. So until until I have the time to dedicate, it's, it's just not going to happen. So you'll see me when you see me, and we'll all learn to live with that. Um, today I'm going to be unboxing a Sophie and Toffee resin box. This is one of the elves boxes um the elves box is their higher tier box so they have the pixie the elves and then they have some quarterly themed boxes so this is the elves the elves is a little pricier i think it's 60 dollars, including shipping a box and that's shipping from singapore so but they always use fedex or dhl or whatever and it always generally gets here on time and super fast and stuff so i'm not too upset about that um, but the elves box is, includes resin and then it will be themed around a certain thing. When I open this up, I've already cut the tape. I haven't peeked unless this is, dang it, people don't text me. You're ruining my video, putting dings in there. Um, I bet the ding was only on my headphones from my computer, wasn't it? Yeah, my PO is over there nodding at me. Um... He refuses to speak on camera, so you'll just get me reacting to him when he reacts to me, which is great. You guys love that. So, I lost track of what I was thinking of. Oh my gosh, I'm so scatterbrained lately, like my meds have changed, and now like I have more energy and everything, but like it's way harder to focus. But this is the Elf's box. <laughs> I think it's like $60 with shipping to the U.S., Okay, so the Elves box will have some resin and then be themed with items for resin crafting that um, go with the theme. And I'll have a little card that tells me what everything is and what the theme is in case I forgot, which I did. And, oh, I was saying I may or may not have seen what's in this box. Something happened to me and it's a travesty and a disgrace to people who like bargains and deals and think they know how to shop. I accidentally ordered three, I accidentally ordered double elves boxes for like three months. So I may have already seen this box because I might have ordered two of them and already opened the other one. But we're gonna find out. So the elves box, I'm going to try and get a good it's got this nice hollow and all of the elves box come looking like this. So let's open the box and it's got this cute dinosaur tissue paper. And then in the top of the box, it tells you, um, and just thanks you for being a subscriber and tells you what hashtags to use if you share your projects, which I do go check out my Instagram shameless plug 5d paint princess go look at it um hopefully there will be an Etsy situation soon oh and then there's always the convention situation which we'll talk about a little later so I am going to hopefully pull all of this out and plop it down on my mat oh no this is mm. Oh. 
I'm impressed. I managed to mostly keep it together. Um, I, I don't want to rip the tissue paper. But sacrifices must be made. Oh. <laughs> I've already seen this one. This is the Carousel Elves box, which is from June, and it's now August. So, have fun with figuring out how long it's been. I'm not going to do it for you, because it'll just make me sad. Cool. Y'all, give a round of applause for the PA <laughs> over in the corner. Good job. Like, that's not a sarcastic round of applause. Like, I need him in here to keep me on task and focused and doing what I need to do. So I ripped all this. I'm just gonna that. So I'm gonna start with this box because I don't know what's in it and I like a good box. Okay. Oh, okay. So this is, the theme for this is carousel and they actually give you the items to make a carousel. Like a little one horse carousel. So, this is the mold for the top. It's very pretty. Oh, it's got like little indentions on the inside. And then it would be cast, a cast resin piece. So you would fill it with your casting. And then this, I believe, is the bottom. Yeah, so this is the bottom, and it's also got cute little indentions in there. It's hard to see them. I don't know if I'm going to be able to show them on camera, but, like, in there, it's all, like, got the indentions to leave in the markings for the carousel on your resin. Okay, this piece... lovely sound effects for you guys. So this is going to be a two-piece mold and it is the carousel horse. So you put it together, fill it with casting resin in the bottom like a so, and then once it has cured, you take it apart to mold it. And you'll have your horse for your carousel. And then this is the pole that goes through your carousel and connects all the pieces together. And this is another two-piece mold. And you put it together like so. Like this. And then you fill it with your resin. And then you'll pull it apart to demold. We have some glitter. I love glitter. Glitter's the best, you guys. Um, so I have this iridescency pink. I've been given a syringe. Um, syringes are very useful in resin crafting. You can Mmm, Southern. Drop that G. Uh, but they're, syringes are very useful for filling shake, shaker charm. Good Lord, I don't know what's going on today, guys, but you've got the Dana that cannot speak. Um, but you can use, ooh, this is a weird, no, it's not. I'm just, I'm just crazy. It's fine. Um, the syringe and you can use it to fill your shaker charms with your liquid mixture for them to have the nice slow fall or a water or some oil, whatever you want to do. But, or you can use these also with your resin to fill the little holes that are hard to get to in some of those upside down ones. 
so these are going to be some open bezel charms. I love open bezels. I need to work on some of these for my next convention. So, real talk, this is my next shameless plug. I have kind of sort of started a business. Well, it's been going, but I want to tell you guys about it. Uh, my friend Shana and I, she is a very talented artist. I will possibly include some of her work in this video, but she, um, she and I are going to conventions and selling her stuff and my stuff and we've been doing pretty good so I want to start inviting you guys to come meet us and see us and check out all of our cool stuff and maybe purchase from us because we're super awesome but if you check the description box you will find the link tree so that you can go to both of our instagrams mine is 5d pain princess which i already shamelessly plugged and hers is mad hatter kyoko and you can check out some of our stuff and what we're designing and putting out and doing with our business and there's also a contact form if you guys have anything you want to request or um i take vinyl commissions now <laughs> because I am a woman of many trades. <laughs> but anyway, back to what we unboxed. I have these charms. They are open bezels and you fill them with resin and design a very pretty charm. These do great at the conventions. And this one is like a carousel top. A carousel horse this one is a frame I really like this one I'm hoping to do something cool with it and then I have a little carousel which is super cute and then they have given me a metallic marker with an extra fine tip and this is in a gold color and it's water based which is awesome I love markers <laughs> so I also they have also given me the resin so the resin they've included with this box is a UV resin for um, silicone molds and they've given me two bottles of that and then they have given me a two-part epoxy resin which uses a three to one ratio which is why I have such a large bottle and then a much smaller bottle and then these would be mixed up to cast and let's see this is a 24-hour cure so three to one ratio resin 24-hour cure time so that is everything from this box so we shall look at our little card so I can show you. Yes. So this is the how the pieces come out for the carousel. And then you put it together. And then it shows us that we get our metallic marker, our open bezels, our confetti, which they have dubbed light pink cotton candy, which, yum, I love cotton candy. And then they're letting me know that I, they have given me a syringe how much resin we have and what ratio and then they have shown us the um uv resin it looks like they may have sent me double the amount of uv resin which uh that's kind of awesome and then for the projects in the boxes such as this one with the carousel they give you directions on how to assemble it which is great because sometimes these projects are really hard they also include a, um, they do a, a challenge for each box, and they also include the winner of one of the boxes and challenges. So that you can see, and then links to all of their stuff, and their inspiration, and instructions, which is great. 
So I really like this box. I think it's super cute. Overall, I like it. I'm excited about it and I can't wait to do a project with you guys at some point with this stuff. It's going to be great. Um, I've got one, two, three, four, five more unboxings to do before I can get to projects. But I look forward to it. Maybe some of them will be this one again or doubles so that I can get to the projects faster. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you follow me on Instagram. Follow Shayna on Instagram. Come see us at our next con. We're going to be at Segoy Expo in Orlando, um, September 9th through 11th. And then we will be at Gamers and Geeks in Mobile on the 24th and 25th of September. So make sure you guys come check us out. At Gamers and Geeks, I will again be judging the cosplay contests, and the theme is horror, so I will have some nice little horror-themed goodies for you guys to check out. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you later. Bye!